RTE podcast. I'm on holiday this week, so I thought I'd take you along. Okay, so where are we going? India. India. The birthplace of chess, calculus, and yoga. They all practice yoga. Traveling here is an intensity like no other. Whether it be by bus, car, or rail, there's something new to see around every corner. I've been blown away by the colors, people, languages, and the number of stray animals. In India, there's almost as many stray animals as there are people. Most of them so charming that you're sure to want to pet them. That one looks like a dog. Here's a few points to keep in mind while petting strays in India. We have your dog. One, make sure they're actually strays. I've seen cats, cows, goats, pigs, and chickens. I wonder who he belongs to. Unlike dogs, these don't typically have a collar, so it's hard to know if there's an owner around. If you're unsure, it's best not to risk it. You'd only be inviting confrontation in a language you don't understand. <laughs> Two, take the necessary precautions. You can assume that a collarless dog in a field of garbage is a stray and therefore up for some petting. Sit, but keep in mind, she. this animal will lack the formal training necessary to sit, shake hands, uh-huh. or even let go, should it accidentally gnaw at your arm. Oh. Approach with caution and watch your step. Oh. Three, safety first. I know you're excited about the petting, but strays are the street mascots of disease. Ensure adequate protection from saliva and other fluids. Get some latex gloves. You can buy them at any Indian chemist. Look for the ones that say medical grade on the box. Then slip them on and pet away. India has a lot more to offer than just domestic creatures. You'll find tigers, panthers, leopards and snakes as you venture beyond the city limits. Once the mall authorities realized they had a leopard walking into the mall, the forest department arrived. By then the leopard had strolled out of the mall and walked into a residential area nearby. I'm staying in a major metro this time, so we'll have to tackle panther petting on my next trip. MTE Podcast is produced by me, Niall Fernandez. All thoughts are my own, with a strong element of satire. Each episode is accompanied by a series of short videos at MTE Podcast on Insta. Oh.